Hi, I'm Dr. Kyle Stanley, and this is my expert tip for today. Use a guide that allows you to see what's happening in the oral cavity. We now have certain guides, like the one from M Guide, where we can design the guide in an open lattice structure. So this allows me to do a few things. One of the things is I can design the undercuts. So let's say I don't have very many teeth in the mouth. I can design fairly uh, tough undercuts so that it holds on even on a few teeth. Now, why is that important? Traditionally, I would always hold the guide down. Having the guide be stable and not needing another hand to hold it gives me another hand or my assistant another hand. So that either either me or her or him can uh, spray water, we can retract, we can suction. Having another hand is actually worth a lot. The other thing is that the surgical field is more visible. So we can, like I said, get more irrigation there. You know, back in the day when we first started guided surgery, we did have some problems with irrigation into the osteotomy because the irrigation was just hitting the guide and going everywhere. Now we have internal drills and we have uh, better ways of getting irrigation, but just having that open lattice of a guide allows us to get better irrigation. So I encourage you to use an open lattice structure on your surgical guides, and it'll help you and your team give your patient a better overall outcome. And that's my expert tip for today.